Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Tasha if you're new, but today I'm going to be doing another review video of Raven Beauty Cosmetics. So if you're new to this channel or you're new to Raven Beauty and want to know a little bit more about them, stay tuned. I got some more shadows and I'd like to share them with you. Okay, so um, if you're an old subscriber, you probably already know that I have a sponsorship with Raven Beauty Cosmetics. And if you're a new subscriber, uh, what a sponsorship is, it's basically a company um, asks for you to review shadows and give your honest opinion about their product. So today I received some more shadows from Annette. Thank you so much, Annette. I love them. Can you tell? I love them. But um, she sent me some more shadows, and I want to tell you a little bit about Raven Beauty Cosmetics before I show you the shadows. Um, if you're new, Raven Beauty Cosmetics is a mineral line, and um, Annette started this line because herself she had a little bit more sensitivity to certain cosmetics on her eyes and face, so she created Raven Beauty Cosmetics. Uh, when you go to her website, you'll see eyeshadows and other type of products on there that you can kind of look at and um, purchase either a sample size product or even a full size jar. Um, so I just thought that was an amazing thing. I mean, she's a small business owner, so she's not this big company like NARS and Smashbox, but a smaller company that creates wonderful shadows at a wonderful price for especially those of you that are on a budget and can't have, that don't want to spend a lot of money on expensive cosmetics. Um, what drew me to her line, um, back in August I tried out her line and I actually was a customer, I purchased um, them and I wanted to see how they felt. The reason why I wanted to purchase, um, because I normally, um, I use Bare Minerals, I own a few of these, but these are Bare Minerals shadows and they're wonderful, don't get me wrong, but the price of them, they are $13 and for Bare Minerals you're getting about 0.57 grams of shadows. Um, and it's, it's a decent amount for bare minerals. I mean, they come in a little jar and they have a big sifter on top. And the jar is pretty thick, so you're not, you're not getting, a, you're getting some good product, but it's not packed full, okay? So I, I like it, but you know, when I went and saw the prices of her shadows, her shadows cost $5 a piece. And of course, the jar looks a little bit smaller, but it's packed filled with 5 grams of mineral shadow, which is a lot. Um, and for the price you get for five dollars this is a lot of shadow her shadows are filled all the way to the top if you can see okay so they're not packed condensed with a sifter so that's one thing that I like you got a lot of product for your money the other thing I like you know her packaging you know it's not fancy like some of the big brands out there and I understand why because it cuts down the cost that would cost us to purchase from her so that's one thing that really drew me to her company and she's a really wonderful person um, to work with so I um, love these now when you receive her shadows they will come in like a little baggie like this and what I like about them is that um, she gives you the option if you would like to have a sifter each shadow will come with a sifter like this and you can put it and compress it down but for me I don't really need the sifter so I really don't use them I like to I'm fine with it using it as it is so that's one great thing you get from her company when you order shadows from her her shipping time is very fast I mean I think she charges two dollars and some change for um, shipping domestic which is really inexpensive but when you receive a shadow it will come with this slip and it basically gives you a description of what the shadow is and then what type of a shadow is it. If it has a shimmer, is it matte, is it high pigmented, low pigmented, all of that fun. So it gives you lots of great information and even gives you the ingredients. So if you have sensitivity to certain ingredients, she will list the ingredients inside the packaging. So I think that's very good that you get that from this um, from Raven Beauty Cosmetics. Now on to the shadows I received. The shadow I received, I received four, and they're gorgeous, you guys. I'll do swatches. Um, but the first shadow I received is called Infinity. And according to the description, they said Infinity is a, a medium blue shadow with red undertones. So I'm going to pull this out. Oh, I must have ate my Wheaties. Oh, here we go. Look how vivid that blue is. It can be a bold blue or it can be, you know, something a little softer like I have in my eyelid. But this is an awesome blue. Um, I'm going to swatch it for you, but it's very pigmented. You don't need a lot. This will last a lifetime, at least for me. I'm just swatching a little bit of the blue on. There we go. But that is infinity. 
it isn't that super pigmented you guys and I do have primer on my hand I'm using the Smashbox photo finish lid primer but that is a pigmented blue for five dollars love this blue um, the other blue they're almost identical but hey I love different shades of blue this one is called blue hydrangea it looks fairly similar but it's slightly lighter than the infinity and I'll swatch that one for you as well So, Blue Hydrangea is slightly lighter, and the way she described this one is basically a medium blue shade with green undertones. So, that's the little difference between those two blues. Now, the last two shadows I received from Annette, let me get my little brush cleaner. This brush cleaner is from Sephora. I love this, and I'm running low, so I'm going to get some more. The other two that I received and that I have on my eyes right now is the green or electric green. Ugh, I can't talk electric green. And this one has a little shimmer to this one here. Uh, it's a brilliant green with a medium sheen. So I'm going to swatch that for you too. So isn't that green gorgeous? has a nice luster to it. And then you guys know, I'm sure you guys, my old subbies, you guys know how much I love my Smashbox Blackout Matte Shadow, right? Where well, I had to check this one out to see if this would be a good contender to replace in it. This is the Carbon. And it's a flat back black and it's pure in its hue. So when I tried this one, you guys, I was like, oh my god, this may be a um, replacement when I run out of my Carbon, or excuse me, my Blackout Shadow. This is black, you guys. It is dark black. So for your deeper skin tones, this is a good black. Okay, now all of her shadows, um, you will see in a tutorial I have coming up next for this look. These shadows you can use wet or dry, and you can use water, whatever mixing medium. If you have Fix Plus, you can use that to use in wet. I'm just going to do one just for the sake of time, but if you use them wet, they go on even more pigmented. I just love them wet. I mean, I use them in two tutorials, but you can almost use this um, carbon as a liner if you wanted to but look at that this is wet and that's dry so I thought these were amazing group thank you so much Annette I love these colors but um, anyway I just wanted to share that with you guys if you guys are looking for some again some wonderful mineral shadows that are just wonderful in quality and the price will not break your pocketbook I would definitely check out Raving Beauty Cosmetics I'll put a link to the sidebar and then stay tuned um, you will see a video coming up very soon if you want more of a wearable look that has a little bit more fun this tutorial will be coming on next and then after this tutorial I will be doing another dramatic for those of you that like dramatic bold intense colors that'll be coming up as well but thank you all so much for watching my video coming to my channel rating commenting and subscribing i do appreciate all of you guys support out there that loves beauty but um you guys have a wonderful week and i'll see you in the next video bye